have refused to let you rest. The Bible says, He that sits in heaven shall laugh. He shall laugh them in derision. So long you are innocent, so long they came after you, I decree the name of Jesus. All the elements, the forces of nature will pursue them. Amen. If you pursue them, Amen. they chase your children, they chase your home. I decree what they wish for you will happen to them. Amen. Those that have said about their dead bodies will you prosper. That thing is a prayer. They pray the prayer. May God answer that prayer. Amen. In the name of Jesus, Amen. your children you labor for. Someone else has taken them as a project that they will not rise. They will not excel. Your home will not be in peace. Your life will be full of trouble. Relax yourself. I'm giving you a prophetic word. Relax yourself. Just hold on to this almighty God. Their lives, they will eat misery as breakfast. Confusion as lunch. Pain as dinner. Because they are vowed not to let your family be. Anything good that they pursue, they won't get it. That's what the Bible says. You say, why? Yeah, this word are too harsh. That's what the Bible says. You want to, you, Psalm 109 from verse 5? Oh, you want to know how harsh? There are even harsher words. And they rewarded me evil for good and hatred for my love. See what they say will happen to them in verse 6. Set down a wicked man over him. Let Satan stand at his right hand. When he shall be judged, let him be condemned. Let his prayer become sin. What's worse than that? Let his days be few. Let another take his office. What is worse than that? Let his children be fatherless, his wife a widow. These are prayers you pray for those who you have supported and they turn against you. Or those who just came after you for no reason. He said, let his children be continually vagabonds and beg. Let them be seek their bread also out of their desolate places. Let the extortioner catch all that he had and let strangers spoil his labor. Let there be none to extend, extend mercy unto him, neither let there be any to favor his fatherless children. Let his posterity be cut off, and in the generation following, let their name be blotted out. Let the iniquity of his fathers be remembered with the Lord, and let not the sin of his mother be blotted out. Let them be before the Lord continually, that he may cut off the memory of them from there. Can you imagine that? From 5 to 15. Anytime you pray, that's the portion of those that come after God's people. Anyone that will not let you be and let you rest by choice, they, they will let you rest by force in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. Oh, thou my enemies, turn back. If you are watching by television, call somebody and tell them it's time to pray. If you are watching online, touch the like button and begin to share the link. Share the link until you share through. Oh, thou my enemies, turn back. Write that down on your page. Write it now. Go to the comment section and write it. Write it as a prophetic declaration for your life. Oh, thou my enemies, turn back. By force, they have no choice. Oh, thou my enemies, turn back. Write it on your platform or everywhere. Write it. Oh, thou my enemies, turn back. Oh, thou my enemies, turn back.